Hey, Earth Sign Couples, and thank you for joining my channel. I am here bringing you your weekend love reading for the 14th through the 16th. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Your guys' first card out is the Six of Wands, the Eight of Cups, the Two of Cups, amazing, Oops. One second. Okay. All right. Your guys is oh, bottom of the deck. Are you guys contemplating leaving a commitment or leaving your partner? You're currently in the hanged man. Clarified with the three of swords. Either you are leaving a long-term commitment, leaving your partner, or you are considering it because your heart's broke. They broke your heart. Could have been a third-party situation, but you are now in the hanged man Yeah, um, your guys' central issue is um, moving into your spiritual journey, and I swear to, I swear that the, uh, the singles one, the singles or in-between couplehood got about the same reading, and this is a completely different deck, <clears throat> but you're moving um, away from a situation that you've had a long-term commitment with. Could be a Taurus, or this could be you, but you are moving away from your partner. Um, your foundation is the Eight of Swords. You feel like you're stuck here right now. You feel like, um, yeah, you feel like you're stuck, but the Eight, on top of Eight, is action is needed now. So if you're going to move away, if you're going to walk away, the time is now. Um, in your past, you feel like this person, um, you had a lot of success with this person. You feel like, um, you feel like you walked away from your soulmate is what I just heard for this group of you. So you could have walked away from a soulmate in the past. And now you feel like you're currently stuck in your situation with your current partner. Yeah. Let's get a couple of clarifiers on this. Why is the Eight of Cups here? The Queen of Wands. You're walking away from your current partner and towards a fire sign female. Or just a fire sign. It could be male or female. But you feel this. You walked away from this fire sign in the past. And now you're returning to them. Because you feel stuck and trapped in this current situation. But you know... Because your future card is the Ace of Cups. So you know in the past you walked away from this person. And now you find yourself ready to walk back to that person. Let's get one on the Ace of Cups here. Yep. You are having to leave one situation behind um, with the current person you're with. In order to achieve the Ace of Cups and the Star. Divine Timing. Well, let me get one on this Two of Cups. The Prince of Cups. So, yeah, you are, um, you've taken some time to really think about this, Earth Signs. You really have. You have healed and been enlightened in this time of, after you walked away from this um, fire sign and went back to somebody else in this time away, you realize that this person that you walked away from was your soulmate. And so now you're leaving your current partner to achieve this emotional abundance, this emotional new beginning. These are a lot like the single readings. Um, because you're not wanting to juggle anymore. You just want to
commit to one person and that is it. Let's see what our angels have for us today. What advice what advice do you have for our earth signs for the weekend? Earth sign couples. My goodness, I keep dropping half of the deck. <laughs> Let's try for one card. One advice card for our earth signs. What are they dealing with? Engagement. So your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. As soon as you break free from a codependent relationship, a codependent behavior, um, whether that be a person, a thought process, a substance, alcohol, whatever it is, um, it's affecting your love life. When you walk away from that, you will ascend to a higher level of your relationship with the person on your spiritual path that is your soulmate with a promise of emotional abundance. So earth signs follow your heart and move in the direction you feel that is, and you'll be just fine because divine timing is here and opportunities have arisen. So um, follow your heart. We'll talk to you guys next time. God bless.